As legal analyst Ricky Kleeman joins us at the table. Ricky, good morning good to morning. you. Good morning. So how much trouble could the parents be in again this time? And the big question, could they lose custody of their kids? Well, they certainly could be in very serious trouble because it's the idea, say someone goes into a criminal court and the case is found guilty or perhaps a no low plea, and then they're put under five years, five years probation. Mm -hmm. And within 60 days, they do exactly the same thing. So what do you think the courts are going to think? Same way here, it's like thumbing your nose uh, at the law when you're under this sword of Damocles for a five-year period. Is what they are doing illegal? No. Um, Maryland law is really specific as opposed to a lot of other states. Maryland law says that a child must be accompanied by someone 13 years or older in two instances inside or in be confined in a car. There is nothing on the books about a child being accompanied by an adult or someone 13 or older if they're outside. So there's this big loophole in the law. So how, why are they doing what they're doing? Well, obviously the uh, Child Protective Services believes that if you leave children unattended outside, they must follow up by law, look at the safety of the kids, and that they had to take the kids into custody. But Ricky, the, I would think that's more traumatizing to tell these kids we're going to take you home and then take you to the police station and then you're being held for hours. Well, that's very, traumatizing. very traumatizing. Now, if this free range parenting group, not just these parents, but others, had a lot of dollars, they could go and contest these laws and contest the behavior. In essence, it's like a false imprisonment, what happened to these kids, even though CPS probably had the best of intentions. Remember this, it's hours where these parents don't know where their kids are and where the kids don't know where their parents are. All right, Ricky, thank you. Thank you very much.